It is reported that when you forget something, you say, Allahumma salli ala Muhammadin wa ala ali Muhammadin wa barik wa sallim. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala opens your doors. You remember Allah, Allah will remind you. So when we forget something, it is from shaitan. When you forget something good, it's from shaitan. So this is why we should constantly try and remember that which is good. How to increase your memory. Cut out everything unnecessary from your life. We're not talking of sin. Sin here is supposed to be out anyway. But we're talking of unnecessary. Some people have a habit of sitting and chit-chatting late at night. Following morning, they can't remember how many raka'at in fajr. But there's only two. They can't remember. Why? Because your mind has rewinded all night the beautiful stories you had all night and you're standing now in salah and you just, you can't remember. Too much on, in your head. Take out some of that. This is why Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, مِنْ حُسْنِ إِسْلَامِ الْمَرْءِ تَرْكُهُ مَا لَا يَعْنِي One of the signs of a good Muslim is that he leaves that which does not concern him. It doesn't concern me, throw it out. Today we are at an age where we are bothered about everybody else's life. And this is a problem wholesale. Nobody can say I'm not guilty. When we hear a juicy rumor, mashallah, it's like we squeezing the lemon. Allahu Akbar. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us goodness. Really, we need to be bothered about our own lives. Cut out unnecessary riffraff and see how your memory improves. May Allah open our doors. <laughs> Do I?